What is up guys, my name is Killer Cloud, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do Uzi spams. So, there's a difference between spamming O's and Uzi spams. I like to call them Uzi spams because they're ultra quick. I mean, they're super damn quick. So, you see a lot of Instagram videos where people are spamming O's at an insanely fast rate, and they're clean, crisp, milky, but they're quick, okay? So, here's the main way on how to do it. So basically, there are three easy steps on how to get Uzi spams, okay? The first step is when you're doing Uzi spams, you want to find a soft pocket on your neck, okay? You can do it on your cheek. It's the same method as Cheerios, but it's easier to do it on your neck. So for the guys out there that are watching me, there's one method, and for the girls, there's another method, okay? So for the guys, on either side of your Adam's apple, there's going to be a soft pocket on the left or right hand side of your Adam's apple. So for me, I like to tap the left hand side, which for you guys, you're looking at me, it's probably going to be on the right, but left hand side, it's going to be to the left of your Adam's apple and right below your jawline. Right below your jawline, you're going to feel a soft pocket right there. So when you're tapping it, that's what's going to create the air pushment, the air movement. Instead of coughing like normal, you're going to be slowly exhaling and you're going to be tapping your throat and that's what's going to create the O's coming out of your mouth. So the same method like Cheerios, you're going to have your mouth tight, very tight, a lot tighter than a regular O. So a regular O with your mouth would be like this. With Cheerios, it'd be a little bit smaller like this. And that's how you get Cheerios with Spams. So I'm going to do an example for you guys right now. Something like that, okay? So what I like to do is the quicker the better, and you want to move your neck, move your entire body actually, so then the O's don't collide together and then hit each other and evaporate, okay? Or dissipate, as we like to say. So I'll give you another example. Something like that. So for the ladies out there, the ladies don't have an Adam's apple, obviously. It's not as protruded as men do, okay? So for the women, I've seen a lot of them do this. Right here, tap underneath your jaw, underneath your um, your chin, and right below in that soft pocket. I've seen a lot of people tap right here. And for the ladies, you can also do it to the left or to the right below your jawline. It works just as well. But um, the main thing people have been asking me for is how to get double spams and triple O spams. Very easy. If you know how to do regular double O's just by coughing and adding that tap on your neck or the bottom of your chin, it's the same thing. It ends up super well. So here are the double O's. So basically it's the same method as a double. You simply put your whatever finger you want, your index finger, your middle finger, whatever you want, and you pull down your top, relax your jaw by dropping it, and simply put it on top. That's it. Just like normal double O's. But now you're going to incorporate the double O with the tapping of the throat, okay? What helps a lot is to slowly exhale. So I'm going to inhale vapor and slowly exhale it like I would be tapping, okay? You want to slowly exhale that vapor. Too much exhaling is going to result in you just tapping and vapor is just going to be shooting out, but it's not going to make the O's. If you do it too little, then it's not going to protrude away from your mouth as quick and how you know, how far the, sh the O shoots out. So you want to find that good medium point between how much to exhale and how little to exhale. Once you get that down, the doubles and, and the triples are very easy to get spams with. The triple O's. Now the thing a lot of people run into with triple O's that's difficult for them is that they get two O's going to the side but the center isn't as clean. Now the issue with that, which, which you're running into, is the fact that 
there's not an even gap between your ring and your middle. I like to use this, mainly because if I'm holding my mod, I don't have to set it down. Boom. I just inhale, and then use my middle and my ring finger. Very simple to do. So, you want to find that good gap. Everyone has a different size mouth. Some people have a smaller mouth, some people have a larger mouth. It all depends on you. But, what you can do if you have a smaller mouth is widen your mouth a little bit like this. And now you have more space. If you have a, a larger mouth, for instance, you simply drop your jaw like normal and then put it on. You want to have an even gap in between your middle and your ring finger. The more crisp that the spaces are, the more even that the spaces are between your left, middle, and right side of your mouth when you put your fingers on, the cleaner those O's will become. And then you'll get clean O's on the left, middle, and right side of your mouth for triple O spam. So I'll give you guys an example. So, that's basically it guys. The spams, the Uzi spams, are super simple once you get down the correct way to either hold your mouth or to hold your fingers. It's vir virtually the same thing as just doing a normal cough double or a normal cough triple. So the normals, I'll show you guys the normals about the speed that I'm going at, and then with the spams, you're gonna be a lot quicker. So first, are I'm gonna do the singles, then the single spams, the doubles, then the Uzi spams, and then the triples with the Uzi triples. A lot of words right there. Anyway guys, let's get this started. So, normal O's. Something like that. So, now, spams. A lot quicker. Doubles now. Spams. Uzi spams. Triples. Triple spams. So, that's it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please give a like down below if you like this video. If you have any questions, please comment them in the comment section down below. And have a great night or day. I'll see you later. Peace out. <laughs> have a great night guys. Later.